Good morning, Raw Stars. It is Monday morning. Yes, it is. And it is time for Monday morning motivation. And I'm excited about Monday because you know what? I woke up today with a bunch of obstacles in my way, right? So I love it when I have obstacles because obstacles are opportunities to be greater than your past. Ah! Because every obstacle will teach you something, not about the world, but about yourself. And if you take a moment and you go, okay, what am I supposed to learn here? This is how you get to be better the next time. So let me tell you what happened to me this morning. This is a funny story. So um, I woke up at 7 a.m. and I was like, okay, so I am going to work on, I listened to some motivational, um, inspiration and I was listening to that and it was about um, creating something new for yourself every day like you get to create something different every day because so many of us live the same day over and over so I was like you know what I'm gonna create a new playlist today so I went on and because you know for YouTube we need a certain uh, type of music and so I have to download the music and create this playlist. So I was really excited I created the playlist and then it was getting late, right? It was like around 8 30 and I'm like I gotta get up. I gotta get ready I gotta go live at 9, right? But I like to push things to the edge, right? So I like to push it to the edge So I got up I got dressed I had my new playlist and I went to hit play and the, the, the Bluetooth button was just not there. It was not there on the computer. It had gone somewhere into like tech land and I couldn't push the Bluetooth button. So I was like, what's up with that? Like, where's the Bluetooth button? So I was in a total panic. I couldn't connect it. I'm running around like a headless chicken trying to connect everything. And then the class was late and I, I found it and it didn't work and then I found it and it worked. I'm like, you know what? I'm just gonna go live anyway and figure it out. Like, we're figured out I'm gonna show up so you always show up but then I said you know let me just try one more time and then it worked right I don't know what happened why it worked but then as I was doing the workout I started thinking like why did this happen to me because listen I do a lot of work on leadership you guys know I coach a course called the mindset makeover and it teaches you on how to see why you source something why you created something so I created this for a reason and when I when you take the time to say okay so why am I at source for this instead of this computer happened that happened it's always somebody else's fault or somebody else did something to you right when somebody else does something to you you can't really solve it so you look at it, you say okay so how did I source this so how I source this is that my preparation is not good enough my preparation is not good enough so what I realized is by pushing things to the very edge right not leaving space for possibility is setting myself up for potential failure right so that was a good lesson so when I'm laying in the bed at 8 30 I need to get up right get up so this is a lesson in the message that I'm sharing with all of you guys on Monday motivation where can you look and say how can I be better and if something happened to you ask yourself how did I source it how did I cause it because if you don't take the time to really figure out like whoa whoa what could I have done differently then you repeat the same mistakes over and over again are you guys feeling me are you feeling me if you don't take that moment to go wow what could, how could I have shown up differently how could I have been differently in that situation so that it won't happen to me the same way again right so this is what I did this morning and this is why I changed the message today to say you are always in control of your life you are always in control of your life if you take the time to reflect and say how am I sourcing this how am I sourcing this for my greatest and highest good right how am I sourcing this so you guys if you have a problem in your life and if, if someone is bugging you if it's your spouse or somebody at work if it's your friend if it's your kid guess what it has nothing to do with that person and everything to do with you so if you want to find out what the problems are in your life right take a selfie baby boom if you want to find out what problems that you have take a selfie look at yourself that's where it is that's where the problem is take a picture and figure out what did what led up to this moment what led up to the moment of where I'm having a problem when you figure that out guess what when you figure that out you realize that you have something that you always want to have in life you know what that is what do you always want to have in life why I tell my daughters you got to get a good education
education, not so that you can get this job or that job, so you can work for this person and that person, but so that you can have what? Woo! You guys, you guys know it? You know the word? What do you have to do? Why do you want to expand your life? So that you can have options. Options, baby. When you have options, that means choices in your life, then you can really create your life. If you don't look in, inside yourself and figure out how can I do better, be better, show up better, then you have a limiting options because it always ends up exactly with you. This is my message for today. Take a selfie. If you have any problems, take a selfie and boom, there it is. There's your problem. So you just gotta ask yourself like, where do I get to show up at 100%? And you can solve the problem. It's a mathematical equation. So I talk to you guys all the time on Mondays to motivate yourself, but it's really about to live a better life, right? To live a better life. And how do you do that? You gotta get out of the routine. Because if you're li living in a routine every single day, what that means is that you're living the same life over and over again. How boring is that? How many people are talking about the same problem over and over again? You call your friends, always have the same problems with men, same problems with money, same problems with weight. I mean, the same shit over and over and over again. Well, why is that? Because it is insanity to think that you can keep doing the same thing and get a different result. Hey, right? So listen, when you catch yourself with a problem, you go, hey, what can I do differently next time? When you think about that, then, then you can get a different result. So that's Monday morning motivation. And I'm gonna leave you with this, you guys. So I'm always talking every single time that I hop on there, I'm giving you guys an opportunity to be great in your life. How many times have you said to yourself, Oh man, I wish I would be in great shape if I woke up every day and I had my own personal trainer, my own private coach right there with me. Well, guess what? I'm giving that to you on the Fit, Fierce, and Fabulous Retreat. You get to have a mindset coach and a fitness coach with you every single day that you wake up. You get to experience that. And when you experience things, then your body remembers it. What? Right? So you can think about it, you can talk about it, but you might forget about it. When you actually experience something every single day, then you remember it. So I want to bring you into the experience of what it's like to live with a mindset and fitness coach that motivates you and lifts you up every single day. That's what's happened at the Fit, Fierce, and Fabulous Retreat. Not only that, not only that, thank you for the stickers, thank you for the stars. So not only that, you guys, when you get to experience something in your mind, body, you get to shift. You get to shift into something greater than you were the day before. What? You get to shift into something greater than you were the day before because your experiences are to the body what knowledge is to your mind, okay? So this is what's gonna happen. When you say yes to the Fit, Fierce, and Fabulous Retreat, you're saying yes to up-leveling your life. How many of you said, well, you know what? I would be in much better shape if I had a private chef cooking for me every day. Bam! Okay, well, you got it. You're going to have healthy meals prepared for you every day. You don't even have to think about it. So you can experience what it feels like to eat healthy and delicious foods, right? You don't have to read about it. You don't have to do it yourself. You get to experience that greatness. And without doing that, right, you don't know what you're missing in life. You don't know. You're only guessing, right? So you get to step into the reality of what it means to be fit, Fierce and fabulous. You get to step into that reality, not only alone, but with me, because guess what? What do I say about, about humans, right? Humans are better together, right? We're better together. Who wants to do it alone? How many times say, I wish I had somebody to travel with, to be with, to have fun with, to share joy with? Guess what? You have somebody. You have me, you have the other rock stars, and you get to do something different. Maybe you want to travel alone for the first time. Maybe you want to learn a little bit about another language, because hablo español y siempre podemos aprender algo diferente, see? So if you want to do something different, you get to experience something different. You can't read about it. You can't just look at it. You get to be about it. So here's the next, the last thing I'm going to leave with you guys with today. Listen, you get to experience, experience, experience. How many of you have said, how many of you have said to yourself, oh, if I had a coach, if I had a trainer, if I had a chef, and if I could just travel wherever I wanted to in the world and have fun and wake up to the beach, I would be just amazing. How many guys have dreamt about that? Okay, how many of you guys have dreamt about that? 
waking up and, you know, jumping in the pool and luxuri luxuriating, breathing, meditating, living your best life. How many of you have dreamt about that? Well, guess what? Here it is. Here it is. It has come to you. If you are watching this, this is because, this is because the universe is saying, here it is. Do you want it? This is possible 100% of the time. The thing fierce and fabulous routine is your opportunity to say yes to your dreams. You get to say yes. You know, one of the most powerful words in the universe is yes, because you're saying yes to possibility, yes to creation, yes to being your best. This is what you get to do on a daily, daily basis, you guys. Say yes to your dreams. Say yes to your dreams. Most of us say yes to this boring ass reality that we keep living over and over again, but you get to make a shift to a higher way of being, right? We are human beings, right? So you get to be your best in every situation. So sign up for the retreat. Yes, I'm telling you, sign up for the retreat. I'm gonna put the link here. Fit, fierce, and fabulous. This is a way of life, right? This is a way of being, right? You get to accept that you are your best. And when you're your best, you can say yes. When you're your best, you can say yes. Okay, you guys, it is Monday morning motivation, right? And I thank God for the obstacles that I had this morning because those obstacles gave me the opportunity to be better than I was before. Every obstacle is an opportunity to be better than you were before. Hey, Pascal Pandy, how are you? Good to see you. Come see me in Tulum. Hey, Ali Shaboob. Okay, you guys, I love you so much. Thank you for all the stars. Guess what? You're a raw star. I'm a raw star. Raw stars bring the light. We rise to shine. Notice I don't say rise and shine. I say rise to shine. That's rising with purpose. To shine means you have a purpose to bring the light wherever you are, wherever you are. So I want to shine all the light that I have on you in person, right? Oh, let's put all of this isolation behind us and step into connection, right? Do you want to put isolation behind us, step into connection, step into health? Remember, as always, you are the CEO of being you. You are the CEO of being you. So budget in your joy, budget in your happiness, budget in your celebration, right? So if you're the CEO, you have a budget, put yourself on the list. Put some vacation time for yourself on the list. Put some celebration time for yourself on the list because you're the boss of being you. I love you guys. Have an amazing day.